What's up everybody? Welcome back to another movie review. Today I'm talking about 1988's Midnight Run. And this starring Robert De Niro and Charles Grodin as Jonathan Mardukas, the Duke, and Robert De Niro as Jack Walsh. And Jack Walsh is a former cop that is kind of a bounty hunter type of deal. He's a finder. He's somebody that finds a person that they need finding and brings them back to where they need him to be brought to type of thing. Um, so, And this one is really good. From director Martin Brest from 1988, this definitely, you know, inspired by or maybe inspired uh, like a planes, trains, and automobiles. It's like a buddy cop, buddy comedy type of thing. But, you know, it, it's just a straight guy and the funny guy and they're together and one of them hates being there. You know, kind of almost like a Shrek and Donkey type of thing. Um, you know, if you're not as old school as me and you know like a planes trains and automobiles i've watched a lot of movies this year folks um you know so there's plenty of things that come to mind but also things that are blanking my mind at the moment but overall this movie got a very good score from me but just how much charles grodin's character pissed off robert de niro's character really made me happy you know like it was so funny seeing De Niro just like you know like this guy's giving him a hard time and just having these smart ass little comments come flying out of his mouth and De Niro just being like if you don't shut the fuck up I'm gonna break my foot off in your fucking ass you know like and you see the look on De Niro's face and you're like I don't know if this is a character for De Niro. I think this guy might just be really pissing him off, you know, like, uh, and then of course they go on this whole journey and adventure and, and he's bringing them across the country and the police are after him, the mobs after him, so much shit going on. And then by the time they get to the end of the movie, it's a sweet little heartfelt moment and it's a beautiful ending and you're like, yes, yes, this is how you end a movie like this, right? Like a lot of the times, in, in more modern days at least, I feel like I get to the end of the movie and the movie ending isn't satisfying and the movie just kind of ends and I'm like, hmm, eh, goodish movie, you know, where like this ended and I was like, that's a good fucking movie, right? Like this is a movie, if you're into just movies in general in Robert De Niro and like buddy cop stuff, this is a movie for you. I would highly recommend this movie. Overall, I gave it four out of five stars, about eight out of 10. I'd probably even gave it maybe a true 10 score would be like an eight, five out of 10. Very solid movie. I really enjoyed this. This will definitely be a movie I watch again in the future. But I'm also at a point in time where like, in the past, I would be rewatching stuff constantly. And now, for the YouTube channel, I kind of am trying to watch as much new stuff as I possibly can. And, you know, just consume more and more and more. And I love doing that. And I love seeing new stuff. But it's also making me, right, like, in the past, I would watch a movie like this and love it so much that as soon as it ended, I would turn it on again and rewatch it. Like, I'd watch the same movie twice in an evening. I haven't done shit like that in maybe this whole year, you know, like maybe one or two weekends I've done that this year. I used to do it every day, you know what I mean? Like, this, so I've really grown <laughs> as a movie reviewer and a movie uh, person here on YouTube in the YouTube space before your eyes and I'm watching a lot of first time watches just on my list here on Letterboxd. This year alone, I've watched 280 different movies. Some I've seen before, some I haven't. Out of those 280, 141 of them, so nearly half, right? 141 of those movies have been first time watches, things that I have not seen before this year. So, and you can find the, that whole list on my letterbox, go check that out, link down in the description below. If you wanna follow my other social medias, links all down in the description below. Comment below your thoughts on Midnight Run, or De Niro, or Charles Grodin. If you have any other De Niro movie reviews or recommendations that you can toss me, I'd love to hear those. If you've got a great movie rec, toss them down in the comment section below. I would love to hear what you guys have been watching or what you think I should watch next. Stay tuned for more movie reviews, breakdowns, Comically Boston's, weekly nerdy newses, 
coming out every week, so stay tuned for more of those. Con content dropping every day. I've posted a video every single day this year in 2024, sometimes even more than one video a day. So there's tons of content out on the channel for you. Stay tuned for more, and I appreciate you guys stopping on by. If you'd like to support the channel more, like, comment, subscribe if you're new, hit that bell so you don't miss future videos. My name is Big Cam, and I will see you beautiful people in the next video. Peace.